welcome to Dreamy English. Um, Hello. It's Kat and Mom, Michelle. And today we're going to be making ice cream in a bag. We're going to make four different flavors. Blueberry, strawberry, chocolate, and vanilla. So we're going to start. taking this ice about half of and we're going to take a gallon bag and put it in so any, about halfway any gallon bags would work just you need to make sure that they will seal nice and tightly so we're going to fill this about halfway yeah like a small bowl mm -hmm. the small ones and then the large ones we just need that to help so I'm just going to about, so I'm just going to work on filling this about halfway. And now, we're going to take a half cup of salt. Now this is rock salt. We're going to use a little bit of rock salt. Rock salt, rock salt works best, but we don't have enough. These okay? So, These bowls? Yeah. Better use. So, move this aside. Put, move this aside? Yes. I'm going to put this so, in the freezer for now. Now I'm going to take some salt. Um, I'm just using regular iodized salt and some rock salt. Can you open this? Yes. I can open it. Good thing. I'm going to... I'm not sure that you can open Oh, you can open I remember because you know Miles, my friend, he's in some videos with me. Um, well, he was he was at my house and we were we had had when we were having the baking the chocolate cake and um, no the cookies the caramel chocolate chip cookies. He at um, he s I took out a Himalayan salt rock and he's like, what's that? And I'm like, it's salt. And he's like, that's not salt. So I gave him one of these. And I said, here. He tasted it. And he ended up having to wash his mouth out in the bathroom because it was very salt. Also, rock salt is very expensive. So I don't want to use a whole lot of it. So we're going to put this in this bag. I'm going to put this aside. So, now we're going to um, start making the part that will become the ice cream. So you're going to use a quart size. So the first flavor that we're going to be making is vanilla. And I'm going to put a half of a cup half and half and I'm going to put this inside of the bowl so that it's easier to pour in it's actually supposed to be a pint size but that's fine whatever it'll still come out fine and now I'm just going to add a half table teaspoon of vanilla Wait, which flavor were we making first again? Let's just make vanilla first. I thought you said vanilla. I, yeah, vanilla that's what I thought I said too. Mmm, that smells good. Yes, it does. And now I'm going to add that in. Can I have this just... Because the vanilla has a habit. Oh, see, there's still a little in there. It has a habit of seeming to like to stick to the bottom. So you have to probably see there's still some sticking in there. But that's okay. So now we're going to add the sugar. We're going to start by... Is there sugar? Yes. I'm going to take two tablespoons. And now I'm going to zip shut the bag so it's closed. And now, can I have the bag of ice? Mm -hmm. 
we're going to take this and put it inside of this bag. Make sure it's in the ice. You probably now I got to, salt on me. It's okay. You need the ice a little bit so you can kind of get that. And I think, I think we want to get rid of the air. Yeah, try and get all the, the air, air out. out of this. Okay. That way you can get the ice around it. And now... I'm going to shake it for five minutes. We're going to shake it for five minutes. So we'll actually be right back because um, we, well, we, we don't want to be sitting here. So we'll be right back. And when we're done, you can come see us. Turns because it gets really cold. The ice is cold. So we're just checking on it. We're definitely so not done yet. You see how it's, it's a bit thick thickening anymore. up? And since it's dripping, that's just because the ice is melting. And it's actually fine. You can see that it's very bubbly up close. And Ross wants to say hi. Hello. All right. Let's um. If you're lucky, it. maybe you'll see the other cat, Jasper. Let's make sure that we get the ice around it. And we're gonna start shaking. We'll be back with you soon. So it's um. So we have this. Um. An idea because it's really cold. See, it's getting there. It's sort of thickening up. You can yeah. see if I pinch it, there'll be like a clear bit. It's really cold, so we're going to try Boy. some. People say that this is a good, refreshing treat. And there goes Ross attacking Jasper. So, but here's the thing, though. We're making this on the first day of December, and there's going to be a huge snowstorm coming later. I think this is almost done. Yep. A little longer is what I think. Okay. Oh, that's cold. Yep. Excuse us for a moment. All right, so welcome back. Mom is right here. So, um, we don't have an ice cream scooper, so we're just going to use this thing. This bowl, this spoon. And we're opening it up. Oh, that's hard. The salt made it a little hard to open, I think. So yeah, now, I think that's good. We have a thick ice cream. It's very thick, like it just came out of the freezer. You dump down. Dump down a little bit to get in the oh. Wow, this is some, this is some sweet, creamy ice cream. I recommend this method of making ice cream to everyone on the planet. Does that work good? Yep. Thank All you. Right. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye, Grandpa. All right. I'm going. They don't want me around anymore. <laughs> Hi. Welcome back. Let me put this aside. All right. We're going to um, be making our second batch, which is going to be chocolate. But for chocolate recipe, for the chocolate recipe, there is a little, um, we need to add the chocolate powder, of course, but we also... So I think we have two oh, teaspoons. Two teaspoons is what I believe. Yes, two teaspoons. All right. So now I'm just going to add this in. And sort of just shake it a little bit so that it gets mixed in well. So we'll All be right. putting some for... Vincent. Vincent in this bowl. Oh, we would probably tell for having his brother in this. Well, we said his name earlier. Oh, yeah. Good so, um, so, um, I'm just gonna use good cook. Good cook ice. So, good news. We found our good cook ice cream scooper. Which doesn't work the best, but, huh? It's better than before. The one that we had for Grandpa. Because that wasn't. That was actually a rice scooper that's used to scoop rice. But. <laughs> We used it to scoop ice cream. And if you wanted, you could smush in like chocolate chips or something into this um, cookie dough. You could probably some cookie dough. What? Be careful. We, if it doesn't come out, we can use the spoon that's for serving. Right. These bowls, I like these bowls. I got them. So strawberries by taking these frozen strawberries and adding a little bit of sugar and defrosting them. So now I'm going to dump this in. Vanilla. Please, vanilla. Vanilla, oops. Throw it. 
So now we're going to add the sugar. And how much sugar are we adding? Two tablespoons, Two as tablespoons. always. Then I'm going to add some strawberries. I think you want to make sure you don't put the liquid. Yeah, I'm not putting any liquid. I'm just whisking the strawberries. How many strawberries should I add? Hmm. How many? That was one, two, three, four, four strawberries. And a little splash of strawberry liquid for good luck. All right. Mm -hmm. Paper towels. Here you go. Those are stick. That's sticky. So. All right, so now I'm going to zip this up, shake it a little to mush up the strawberries. So this is what it looks like. Open mm. up. Nice. Make sure that you get it all, the, the ice all surrounding it. And again, we're going to shake it in a bowl. Don't forget to set the five minute timer, Mom. All right, I'm going to set. A five minute timer on the time timer. Yeah. All right, so we'll be back soon. And I'm gonna start scooping the stuff out. Just a big scoop. About a spoon, so I could taste it too. I think the strawberries might have helped, yeah, because they were, although they weren't frozen. But they were bigger, so. That looks good. It does. So now I'm gonna get what I can out of there. Let's see. That actually looks really good. I got those bowls in Disney World. All right, so I'm going to have this one. I want to have a taste. Mm. How is it? It's very good. Well, I'm glad that you like it. Maybe you could give me a little bit of this. This is as good as Cherry Hill. Yeah. I don't think we need to buy ice cream anymore. Yeah. We just need to buy more half and half. Mmm. Alright, welcome back. We're going to be... And putting it in this bowl, so... Let's move this aside. And now I'm going to smush in some blueberries. <gasps> I just had a really good idea. What is it? You know how we use strawberries? We're using blueberries. But we ha there's one thing we haven't used. Well, how many guys? My have? angle. Well, maybe we'll do that later. Just a little bit more. A little bit. A little bit more. The blueberries I there's more in there. All right, let's show. These are wild blueberries from Maine. Yes. Family owned in Maine. So now I'm gonna start. Squishing these. Mmm, it's pretty good. I like it. It's like it's similar to the strawberry, but it's blueberry. All right, I'm gonna put it in the freezer. I think it's later. Mm. Hey, welcome back. Um, we're going to the final flavor is gonna be coffee chocolate, and we're gonna be doubling the recipe. So, if you watch your, if you watch, if you well, you probably watched the rest of our video to be getting to this point. If you're just, we're just going to be doubling the recipe, but if you want to make it only for one serving, then you don't need to double the recipe. You can just use the same amount as we always used for our last video. So here, now this is the amount that we're going to be using. We're going to put it inside the quart size bag. Put that in. Add the vanilla. Alright, so now we're going to add 
since we would be adding an extra half of a tape, teaspoon, one, two, three, four. Oh, four tablespoons. And we're going to add some Folgers instant coffee. Wait, not yet. We, not need, to yet. Add, uh, we need to add a whole teaspoon of sugar now because normally it would call for an extra half teaspoon if, we're, oh, right. if we were using the chocolate, but this time mm -hmm. it's gonna be a full. Okay, so for the coffee, we're just gonna add a half a packet of this instant coffee. And I am meanwhile going to add in the chocolate powder. I'm going to need a paper towel to wipe this up because, as I said earlier, this stuff is messy. Did you add the coffee in? Yep. All right, here. So move that to the center so you guys can see. And wipe this down. So now... So now I'm just going to let up some air. So that it has room to mix around and stuff. So we're gonna put it inside of the middle of this bag of ice. Ooh, it smells good. It smells really good. I'm get the ice all around it. Don't put my don't have my hands stuck in there. All right, now for the cap, and let's put five minutes on the time timer. And we will be back in a little while. Mm, needs more time. Yeah, definitely. It's very liquidy. I wonder, just wonder, if that may, if it's double the recipe, doesn't that mean double the shaking? Probably. <laughs> well, we'll be back in a little bit. So add more time to our time timer. Oh, we um, had to get Vincent involved. Mom's arms were getting tired, and I was getting tired, and it splattered. Double the recipe. Still. Still. Oh my goodness. Still. Double the recipe takes way longer. It's a little thicker, but not a right, So I just want to go over some of the things that you need to make ice cream. We kind of made the video, but some of the things that you need would be the ice, the bag of ice. And you would need these gallon size bags to Ooh. use. Um, freezer ones would be best. I'm not sure. I think this was a storage, but I should have bought freezer ones because they would probably work better. And again, you probably would want freezer ones. I bought storage quart bags or pint bags that would be smaller. All right. So you want your ice, and you'll want to put how much how much salt? Half cup. A half a cup of. Can you bring a half cup measure? half a cup of salt that you would want to put inside. So you'd pour it in here and you would pour it inside of the ice. And what best works actually is this rock salt, Himalayan rock salt. We used a little bit of it, but it's more expensive. But regular table salt will work just fine as well. They actually sell ice cream salt as well. So that's what you would need. Then you would take your other ingredients and you would put them in the smaller bag. So this would be your quart size or your pint size bag that you would use. And you would put in your half and half. And you would put in, how much half and half? Half cup. A half a cup. So that would be right here, a half a cup or this much. But this, you would want to put it inside of this because this would be for liquid. So you put your half a cup in there and you would pour it inside of this. Then you want to have two tablespoons of sugar. So this is the sugar. 
two tablespoons of sugar, and inside of here is my tablespoon measure. Measure, and you would take your sugar. You would take two of them and put them inside of the small quart bag. And how much um, vanilla? A half teaspoon. So you would need a half a teaspoon of the vanilla, which is this one here. This is my half teaspoon of the vanilla, and the kind I bought today was Dominican style vanilla. Okay. So that's what you would need to just make vanilla ice cream. Now to do the flavors, we took a number of different flavors. We first made for the chocolate, we used Gerardelli chocolate, and we would use what? Two teaspoons. Which Two one teaspoons. Sorry. And then you would also add Two a half. You would also add a half teaspoon of vanilla. And then you would add an extra. I mean sugar. An extra half teaspoon of sugar, sugar to make the chocolate ice cream. So that's what you would do for chocolate ice cream. For strawberry ice cream, I took these strawberries and I put them, I defrosted them because they're frozen, and I put a, I put like about a tablespoon of sugar to let them get really liquidy, and that's what we used. We put in about a handful, after, about a handful. after we make the mixture of half and half and vanilla. Right, so after we mix that half and half of the half and half and we put the sugar, in the vanilla, we would put about a hand. For the blueberry, we just took these frozen blueberries, frozen blueberries, wild blueberries from Maine, and we put in about a handful of these blueberries. Now for the last one that we made, the chocolate, the chocolate coffee, we took a half a packet of this instant coffee and then we also added another half teaspoon. So two sugar. teaspoons. This would be the two teaspoon. We added, we added another half teaspoon of sugar. Right? And so those are the ingredients that you'll need and the different things. You would also need an ice cream scoop. It works better if you have an ice cream scoop. And you want your and your measuring cups and your measuring spoons and your serving bowls. And these bowls are from Disney World and they have cats in them. All right, so that's everything that you need to make this. Welcome back. We have our bowls and we're going to dish it out. Oi. And I could use some coffee ice cream because uh, I'm so tired. You really want more, don't you, Mom? I do. Although I might get a little cold. Try not to get down the floor. Alright, so start by giving Mom some. You can eat that one. And then I'll spoon out some other ones. Mm. This is good. Is it so good? Yum, yum. I'm going to give my brother Vincent two scoops because it was his, um, because I, I promised him. Two. Yeah, you'll get another one. I just thought I'm just going to give him two for now because he won't be wanting to come back for a second. That one will be for Vincent. Now, Mom, let me get myself a second, and then I'll get you a second. So, if you like this video and you want to find out some more recipes, please make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Yes. It doesn't look like there is no scoop for me. There'll be plenty, Mom. And what else? Oh, if you want to know how to make other things, or if you have recipes, do you have a recipe for ice cream or something, you can put it in the comments below. That doesn't look like I got a whole scoop. I gave you most of my strawberry, didn't I, Mom? Now I'll just take this, too. 
Alright. I'm gonna go deliver this to my brother Vincent. Alright.